What's up everybody, it's Concrete Zebra with Craftmaster Productions and Studio1Tutorials.com and today I'm going to be showing you a quick and easy streamlined way to find new sounds in Omnisphere. What's up everybody, it's Concrete Zebra with Craftmaster Productions and Studio1Tutorials.com. If you haven't been by Studio1Tutorials.com to check out the Buy Sounds link, you're playing with yourself. You gotta go by there, listen to It's a Sub, because these 808s are savage. Now, um, I was, um, you know, just continuing my, uh, you know, just my all out appreciation and love for spectrosonics omnisphere um this is the god synth and um the thing is when you first get it and see um especially especially you little assholes that hack it because you don't understand what you have but um when i even when i bought this synth i bought i i, I saved up i spent uh, i spent the five uh the 500 for it and um when i first got it i i didn't i didn't use it um like i use it now like pretty much now i make it, everything in omnisphere but when i first got it, i didn't really use it because it was just so intimidating the uh, the patch library and finding the stuff that that i wanted and everything and now um I, i've really gotten familiar with the browser and the browser is so powerful and so easy to use and um it's really easy to get inspired, but there is just a ridiculous amount of presets. Like it's it's unheard of how many presets this thing has. And um, you know, they just released uh if you have Keyscape and Omnisphere, you get the Keyscape creative patches, which are wow. And um so the way that I kind of go through and get inspired is um um I'm I'm browsing just the Keyscape scape creative patches. First of all, you can uh they have different you know different um preset banks. So you can kind of narrow it down to, you know, that. So like I'm like boom, I want I want to get into Keyscape creative and now I set my subgroup which is keyboards, you know, I want to start with some keys and um you know, still I got a ridiculous amount of presets within there. Um so the way that the, I, I discovered this button, which is which is super useful and the way that I kind of find new stuff is I'll just hit this button. And what this does is this randomizes um, all the presets. So when you scroll down through it, you don't have that same um, that same um, rhythm and um, just um, order that you normally have so i'll just find something in here and just and just run through it you know play some chords all right that's cool if i was like gonna make like some jazzy acid house or some shit let's see what else i got That's a little soft. See, so yeah, I've, I've never used this patch right here. I'm, I'm, this is like the first time I've heard it and I've been fucking with Keyscape Creative for a while and I like it. Yeah, so, all right, so I found the patch I like. It was that easy to find it, a completely different and new patch. And now I'm going to cut this off and make the track. This is Concrete Zebra with Craftmaster Productions, Studio1Tutorials.com. Keep it simple, don't be basic, and we'll see you on the next one.